everyone and welcome back to my channel and thank you for joining me. If you're new here, hi, I'm Sam, a mum of two boys and we do all sorts on this channel. So stick around, hit that subscribe button and let's jump straight into the video. So I've had this stuff sitting here for a week and I haven't filmed. Um, I actually hid it under my bed and I think because I put it under my gas lift bed, I totally forgot about it. So the other week I went and did a bit of shopping. There was a mix of household bits, um, the C word stuff, the kids are out there. Um, and all sorts, so I just thought let's throw them into a video. So, I'm going to try and remember where everything was from. Um, I'm really sorry if I can't, because like I say, it's sat there for a week. This, amazing, I've got, I've got to get the ring light on at, I think it's one o'clock in the afternoon, it's that dark already for winter. So, I grabbed this for the eldest. Um, this was £16, which for a double in this material, and I actually opened this little thing, so I had a feel before I went into the shop. Oh, you can open it more than I thought. It is really soft, so he's going to absolutely love this because he loved the one I got him for Christmas last year, so um, yeah, so he's going to love that. So I went into Wilkinson's. In fact, I'll try and pull out everything from Wilkinson's um, and kind of keep them shot by shop. So I got this for the youngest. This was on offer. Um, if you have a younger child that's into the, um, so I've just sent little ears downstairs because, um, yeah. So if you have a youngster that's into Lego, um, obviously Lego can be really expensive that I find Wilco's brand of it, obviously it is compatible with all the other Lego brands. Um, that it's really good, even at full price, but uh, they often have their sets on offer and stuff. Um, this was a couple of pound. He will enjoy this, and I know, don't need to worry that it's like really expensive and he's just gonna break it up and it'll end up in a, the Lego pile we already have. So some of the other bits that I picked up from Wilkinson, I've tried to sit them all on my knee. Um, I got two bags of these, because these were on offer. These are the eight hour tea lights. Now, I use wax melts a lot in my house, um, and I prefer the eight hour ones. Now I'm sure these were on two for five pounds, but they're normally I think three pound a bag. Um, and there's 30 in there, so it's like you only need one. So they last like the they last a month if you use one a day. Although I've got multiple burners. I picked up some new ribbon for my tree. So this is a three meter one. I think this was either a pound or one pound fifty. It is, I'm gonna open it and show you, it is a wired one which is great when you're wanting to bend them and stuff on to put on your tree. You can use these as like gift wrap as well. Um, this is really pretty. I love the fact that it's got a little bit of sparkle in there that when the tree lights catch it, it would look so pretty. I picked up two of their spray cans because when I went shopping these were on offer, although even when they're not on offer, Wilco spray cans are really, really good. Now I've got some wooden bits that work that need to spray, so I bought a primer which I don't think I've ever used the primer before. Um, and I brought this satin because the, the gloss to me is too shiny and I wouldn't want a really shiny finish. I also picked this up. Now, I think this is from Wilkinson's. I am not quite sure. Um, wherever it was, it was on offer for a fiver. And this is one of the Christmas, new Christmas ones. It's Winterberry Treat. Um, I'm going to actually set this up downstairs in the... Um, downstairs like toilet towards the end of my kitchen type area and um, near the shower room I also picked this up because it was on offer I think they were they had like a little reduced section and it was like um 50 pence and I just thought I'm actually gonna throw this in Alfie's stocking because I thought actually it's getting to that it oh no maybe I won't because it's the ice one it's got mint in it Maybe it'll go in Dylan's and I'll get Alfie his own little miniature ones to go in his stocking. I just thought it's at that age now of very nearly six at Christmas that they start to get into things like that. He's starting to want to do his hair and stuff. So I also picked up in Wilkinson's some cat treats because these little packets have 10 sticks in them um, and I find they're a really good price and my Kit Kats love them. I also picked up a couple of packets of these. These are the floor wipes. Um, with it being wet and rainy outside and having three cats, um, sometimes I am wiping windowsills and floors down from muddy cat prints um, and these come in really handy. 
So I've picked a few bits up in um, Home Bargains while I was out and I actually picked this up for myself. I'm going to wrap this for Christmas from Santa to me. Um, I always do a few little bits because um, Alfie always asks, is Santa bringing presents for you mummy? So I've wanted one of these for ages. In my kitchen I've got a wall that is chalkboard which I actually don't use on chalkboards on it anymore because of, I struggle to get the pens off it. Um, so I'm going to put one of these because it is lining paper on there that I'm going to actually do myself one of these big massive, I don't know if that's going to focus, yeah. So it's a big massive clock that's like stuck to the wall. Um, this was only something like three or four pounds, maybe four ninety nine at the most. Um, I thought that was a really good bargain. I picked these two little gifts up to go in Dylan's stocking. Um, so these are little puzzles. Now he likes things like this. Um, he likes fidget spinners and, and stuff that are, all help with keeping the mind active, I suppose. Um, so I thought these, were, I've never bought him anything like this. So I thought these were cool little things. I think these were like 39p or something like that. They were really cheap. I picked this up for Alfie. Now, Alfie uses drinks cups because, big drinks cups because he does drink a lot. Oh, it's broken. It's got a crack in it, although it is on the outside and it's, I'm hoping that it's still watertight because it's got, it's double walled, so it should be absolutely fine. Um, I thought this one was really cute. Um, and things like this, the little elf brings, um, when we've had really, really good behaviour, the elf will bring a little treat instead of being naughty. Or the elf's mischievous, naughty, whatever. Yeah, you get what I mean. Um, I picked this little set up for uh, Dylan's stocking. This is going, this was from Poundland. Um, he likes these little kits because of the, a lot of the little rulers and stuff fit in his top pocket. He has a pencil case, but he stuffs lots of his pens and rulers and stuff in his top pocket. Um, and this is a really good brand. I think some of these were from... Poundland, and I think some of these were from Home Bargains. Now, through the lockdown, the first lockdown and ever since, I have used my stash of Sephora. Um, I only have a couple of bottles of like a few different scents and stuff, but I have completely drained it to nothing. I do not have one bottle of Sephora. So, when I saw the Christmas scents were out, which are my favourite of all, I picked myself up some. So, I picked up Winter's Morning. I picked up two of the warm cinnamon. This one is one of my favourites. I love putting this in the sink with the cloths because you can smell it all through the house when you wake up. At, like put it on at night time when everybody's asleep. Um, and I picked these two up. So we have got Winter Spice, which I thought was a new one, but it's not. They've just changed the colour of the bottle, and uh, the packaging. And I picked up the Cranberry and Orange. Um, I think there is, oh, I think there is some, I think there is some actual new scents um, out there, but I'm like, these ones I really do like, so, and I'm not coming across those at all anywhere. So, I think that was everything I picked up, unless there was bits I've picked up and I've taken out of the bag and I can't remember. Maybe. Oh, in Primark, I also picked myself up um a new bed sheet and pillowcases in now i've got the bed sheet on but i actually forgot i bought the pillowcases because i've got a primark haul to film too um and it's sat there again um <laughs> so the the sheet is on my bed but i picked the pillowcases up in the same color as well so this is brushed cotton these were three pounds for obviously two pillowcases i think the sheet was six um in a double I love brushed cotton in the winter. I just feel that it's, you never get that cold feeling. Like when you get in bed sometimes with a normal sheet, it can feel cold. With brushed cotton, I don't get that. I don't know if it is the brushed cotton or it's just a mind trick. I don't know. But I absolutely brush co love brushed cotton bedding sets and I've never had a sheet or pillowcases. I suppose you, these wouldn't really matter because you don't lay on these. But I've never had a sheet, so I treat myself to a sheet and some pillowcases. Um, so that was everything I got. I hope you enjoyed this. A bit of a really random one. Um, I shall see you all in my next video. Goodbye.